Welcome back. We're keeping it local this morning. It's never too early to get in the Halloween nope. spirit, and you can do just that as local haunted houses open for the season this weekend. And our own Tickles the Clown gives us a live look at the terror that awaits us. John. <laughs> Brittany, Shelly, let's uh, take a look at what we have here. Wham, I got my umbrella. And we got Liz Van Pay hey, back on the show. Here, yeah. I would shake your hand if I had a... Yeah, you don't have any free hands. <laughs> no, it's, you know, time flies when you're clowning around. That's very true. <laughs> but, uh, any hooser, where are we right now? Uh, we are in one of the scenes of our Twisted Trail, which is kind of our, uh, our woods attraction. Um, you know, when you come through, this is definitely one of the things you're going to walk through. Of course, there's a lot more to it when it's nighttime and it's not raining, and I've got, you know... 10 actors in here, but... Well, th this sets the tone right here. It gives you a good taste of, of what to expect if you come see us here at Cream this year. And then you've got, uh, I mean, there's there's a couple of creepy acts out here right now. I, I, I think Jingles is lurking in the background there, and you've got some... He usually is. Some scarecrows or something. Yep, there's, there's all different kinds of elements, you know, out here, you know, between set pieces and actors and things like that, just to kind of set the creepiest tone we possibly can so that people get scared, because that's our job. And you guys are more fans of uh, face paint like I've got on right now, yep. than actual masks. So, I mean, talk about that. Why is that important? Um, it's, it's you know, I feel like it just, it uh, definitely, <laughs> what are you doing? He's, um, he's sniffing. That's yeah. how he, uh, I mean, it definitely, it shows off the talents of our makeup department and the, and the people that we have on a nightly basis helping to make us as scary as we possibly can be. I mean, yes, we do have masks. There are some characters that do come um, in masks or some of them do prosthetics and things like that. But, you know, nine times out of ten, you're going to have a character in makeup and not in a mask. And uh, this is purely a volunteer-driven effort. Yep. You said that, really, everything stays in the community. Yep. Uh, everything that we do here benefits the Beja Shrine of Green Bay, and all of the money uh, that we make does stay within uh, the community of Green Bay. So it's a good, it's a good thing for a good cause. And, uh, you know, how can people get involved? I mean, whether you want to volunteer or whether you want to come out here and get the pants scared off you. <laughs> uh, GreenBayFear.com is the best place to go. Uh, we do have a volunteer tab on our website um, that does have any, you know, all of our volunteer information, paperwork, things like that. Um, one of the things that we do, our volunteer stuff, um, it does go for any community service hours that any kids would require for school or things like that. So it's a fun way to get your community service hours at the very least. Awesome stuff, Liz. Hey, thank you so much for being on the show you and putting up with me and ah, decking me out, <laughs> recruiting me to the clown posse here, the clown cult. Oh, no. There's some American Horror Story <laughs> stuff going on here. But, uh, hey, thank you, Jingles, as well. Absolutely. <laughs> All right, back to you guys.